Hey everyone, so I found this really cool app that helps you um, keep uh, keep record of all your games that you have and all the games that you may want in the future. So every time me and my wife go out and collect games, sometimes I have a hard time remembering uh, games that I do and I don't have in my collection. So the app is called Video Game Collecting Tracker. And basically, um, these are all the games that we have. Actually, Aaron just got done putting about most of these in here. So these are all the games we have. Um, you can choose to do it alphabetical order, and then you can also choose to have it in genre. That's what I did because it looks better. <coughs> Here's all of our Nintendo 64 games. This app would also be good if I'm at Second and Charles and I want to like kind of show off my collection or, you know, just something like that. And this is for Google Play. I don't know if it's for... I don't know if it's for uh, Apple, but I know it is for, it's, it does work on Android, and it does work through the Google Play Store. Um, and this is just some of the PlayStation 1 games. This isn't finished yet. This is just some that we've done today. We still have to add all of our Sega stuff. GameCube, Game Boy, Game Boy Color, all that good stuff. Um, and here's our wish list. So if, I, if I'm ever out and I go, man, you know, what's a game that I might want? And this helps me remember. Or if I'm out and about, I can just randomly add it. To it so basically this is real easy you hit the plus sign um i use the giant bomb i don't really know what the difference is but <coughs> pick your platform and if you ever download uh roms or um emulators then you'll be used to seeing like gba gbc and stuff like that so if i want to do like game boy game boy color and i'm gonna just add a game that i know i have so i do pokemon And I wait for the Pokemon games to pop up. Pop up. This one that very slow. So okay, I know I got a Pokemon Crystal, and it does load the actual art. Is this my internet's really slow? So you can either. It depends on if you have it in the United Kingdom, Japan, or the United States. So I know I have it in the United States. So I'm gonna do Add to Collection, and I'm done. I also have Pokemon Pinball, I have Gold and Silver, which that's actually real easy, because it, oh, okay, there it goes, that's individual, so I do Game Boy, and then I also have Pokemon Silver, and if I see something in here I don't have, or I might want, like the Pokemon Puzzle Challenge, I can hit it, and add it to my favorites, or add it to, yeah, or add it to my wish list. And then as you see, I go back, get more color, and it adds it in here. And it just gives you a little information when it was when it was created, it gives a description of the game and all, all that cool stuff. Tells you it's one player, you know, US region Pokemon, who it's made by, and all that cool stuff. So um, maybe this is an app that can help you. If you like this video, please leave your comment down below. If you like videos like this, please let me know. Also, don't forget to follow me on YouTube and Twitch, where I stream nightly. <coughs> Alright guys, y'all have a good night. Thank you.